Okay, we want to show you the proper technique for banding the grip onto the cable using the pocket tool. What you'll need on this for hand tools is you'll need the pocket tool, your tape, you'll need a hammer, you'll need cutters, you need a pair of pliers. You do this the same way as you did our others. You slide your grip all the way in, tape the end of your cable to where it doesn't damage the grip on the inside when you're sliding it on. This banding now comes in 100 foot rolls. You'll get a box banding. You'll also get a box of clips. The way you make this band is you'll pull out a length of band out of the box once you cut your band to length, you slide your clip on, take your pliers, fold over about three quarters of an inch, clamp it, pinch it down, slide your clip on with the ears towards the end of the clamp. Okay, you pinch it on down and you loop it around. Once that's done, then you will install it on the cable. You slide your band into the tool. Pull it down tight, fold it over. Cut it with your arm of the, the cutter. Bend it around and crimp the ears. And you take your second band, Install it the same way, two to four inches above the other clamp. Pull it down tight, fold it over, cut it. Once you get that band bands on there, take your electrical tape and tape over them. This is to make a smooth transition from the cable diameter to the diameter of the grip. Do not use duct tape in this process. Duct tape balls up and it will create a, a, a problem going through your shivs. Okay, once you tape the bottom end of the grip, go ahead and tape over the second band. It just helps create a snag-free transition. There you have the proper technique to banding a, gr a grip onto the cable.